So, DJI's most popular drone series is facing quite some backlash. Yes, we are talking about the DJI Air 3, which has created lots of controversies among drone enthusiasts since its introduction. The DJI Air 3 came up with an innovative dual primary camera system consisting of a wide-angle camera and three times medium telecamera. Yet, many fans are disappointed with this drone and are waiting for the rumored Air 3S, which is expected to appear with a one-inch sensor. So, what makes the Air 3 not so much of a worthy upgrade? Will DJI release the Air 3S with a larger sensor? And if so, when? In our video today, we will try to answer all of these questions and share our expectations for the DJI Air 3S. If we go down memory lane, the Air 2S did bring up some hefty upgrades compared to the Air 2, with an improved camera sensor, more range, and better flight time. However, the Air 3 also came up with all the upgrades, except DJI downgraded the camera sensor. Both the lenses of Air 3 are equipped with a 1x1.3-inch CMOS sensor, the same as the Mini 3 Pro. In fact, the 24mm wide camera is worse than the Air 2S lens. Also, if we talk about still images, the larger sensor of Air 2S combines with the 20 megapixel camera to provide picture quality with less noise. And the worst part, the Air 3 can shoot only at 4K resolution compared to the 5.4K of the Air 2S. So, judging by the specs, the Air 2S is better until the 70mm telelens comes in. However, since both lenses come with fixed aperture, you have to use ND filters while shooting in harsh daylight. So, you see there were mostly downgrades, rather than upgrades. But don't worry, Air 3S is on the cart to save the lost reputation. If we check out the previous launching schedules, there was roughly a year gap between the DJI Air 2 and Air 2S. Following the trail, since DJI Air 3 was launched in July last year, it would be pretty safe to assume that the Air 3S might be available in July this year. Though there are also rumors for an avatar refresh, we might see both drones in a similar time frame. But to make the Air 3S worthy of attention, there is no alternative to a bigger sensor. The Air 3S is expected to feature a 1-inch sensor for higher resolution and more details. Also, for still images, DJI needs to upgrade the lens to an actual 48 megapixel camera. Then again, the Air 3 does not allow you to shoot vertical videos like the Mini 4 Pro, which is surely disappointing for many fans. Like, most of your captured shots are for social media, and you have to crop the shots from Air 3 for vertical videos, which also decreases the details significantly. So, we would hope the Air 3S will bring back the vertical mode, rotating the camera, so that we can get video and image content straight from the drone and post it directly to your social media accounts. Another crucial but significant upgrade could be the support for DJI RC Pro. The current Air 2 only supports DJI RC 2 due to the recent OcuSync 4 integration, which brings both good and bad to the table. So, if DJI can provide support for the RC Pro with the Air 3S, it would be pretty convenient for pilots, as they can carry multiple drones and maneuver them with one controller. It is quite obvious that the Air 3 couldn't live up to its name, and the Air 3S has quite some shoes to fill. So, if you are also wondering whether you should get the Air 3, or wait for the Air 3S, our suggestion will be to wait a bit longer, as you might get some useful upgrades for a better aerial shooting experience. But for now, which DJI drone is your favorite? Throw all your thoughts in the comments, give this video a thumbs up, and subscribe to our channel to keep yourself updated with all the latest tech news.